<laughs> oh lord, I'm be dropping crab legs. Welcome back to the vlog. I'm in the car. I'm on my way to Maryland to hang out with Marissa and AJ for the weekend. We got tickets to, I think it's called a big ass cookout, but that's tomorrow. So I wanted to get there today. Is that on the screen or, okay, yeah. I wanted to get there around noon, but it's noon now and there's hella traffic. And I'm in a little bit of traffic now, but I should be there in an hour. Monday on our I'm thinking I'm gonna start calling them like mush Mondays or mommy Mondays or something because Mondays are the days where my grandfather has like aid coverage for the whole day or majority of the day so my mom can actually like do stuff and we were gonna hit the beach but since I'm gonna be up near DC she was thinking about taking the train up to DC and we can do the beat the bomb excuse me the beat the bomb escape room and then we just drive back, she took the train up. So hopefully she looks into that and we can do that on Monday, that would be fun. And yeah, but as for right now, I'm in traffic. I left around 9.45, so it, I should have gotten there around like 11.45 with no traffic, so it added like an hour and 15 to the trip, but some of it is just slow down, some of it is accidents. I brought, I had a bottle of wine and then I brought um, a bottle of like red sparkling because the lady at Total Wine said that it was good and then I got a new tequila that I haven't tried before. So we shall see. Oh, also random, but I start, I did, no, I decided to do a step challenge for the month of july i'm starting at beginner it's the lydia dinga step challenge so i'm starting at beginner which is 5k steps a day so i got up this morning i went walking and i have met my 5,000 steps for the day i feel like i might be able to do 10 but I didn't want to do like to start with 10 and then not meet the goal and then just feel bad so I started with five and we're gonna go from there so yes I will talk to you all later when I get there and to get settled welcome to District of Columbia welcome to Maryland Alrighty guys, we went to AutoZone. Got myself a break, baby. <laughs> because they are not getting my Sylvester, okay? The Kia boys are not gonna get my Sylvester. And if they do, they worked hard for it. So shit, they might deserve it. <laughs> we all walk with exquisite pussy. Thank you for doing that just as soon as I turned on the camera. <laughs> Literally, as soon as I turned it on, you talk about pomposity. Sorry. <laughs> Way to go. I support women It's not getting cut out either. I always wonder why they make these plastic things so damn hard. Like, Jesus Christ. I said, to make sure I can cut the little zip tie off. Okay. Phew. That's that cool. Did you both like, bow, 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 I don't think you were recording. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> Press the button to turn it off and it started. Cause they won't get my Sylvester. Yay! I so bad at all. I pay 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 so bad.
so bad at all chilled out and we went to lunch or like dinner by the time we actually like got ready and left went to po boy gyms that was really good i had a what did i have a grilled chicken po boy i think it was called the atlas it was very good and i had a dc hurricane i don't know if i got a video of that though and then um what else well first we took the train to like u street and got off and realized it was raining and so we were like hmm do we want to walk in the rain or do we want to just go back and drive somewhere else so we went back and we drove to popo gems that was very good and then we came back and what did we do we went to safeway for snacks and like um drink mix to mix with the tequila and then we played culture tags that was fun they never played culture tags before and i'd only played like maybe once or twice so that was cool and then we just chilled out we had essence fest on the tv and we're getting old because we didn't make it to see missy elliott i feel like it was like 12 30 and she still wasn't on the stage and then we were like you know what we'll catch it on the internet another time i'm sorry if i have like crust and stuff in my eyes i have not washed my face or brushed my teeth so yes i'm talking to y'all with yuck mouth right now so today i think we're gonna make breakfast like have a little at home brunch and i don't know if we have anything planned before the cookout it's like cloudy but the sun is trying to peek through but it's supposed to rain later but it's only like 30 percent chance so hopefully that just doesn't happen i slept with like a weighted blanket i had like it was very comfortable but like when it would start shifting and i had to move it it's like you really need muscles for these bad boys i feel like i gotta work out in my sleep yeah i'm gonna get up shower wash my face brush my teeth all that good stuff and get our day started.
I'm talking quiet because I don't know if they're still asleep. But it is about 8 o'clock and I'm packing up. I'm going to head out because my mom decided to take the train up to D.C. We were going to try to do the beat the bomb, but you need four people for that. So she's going to take the train up to D.C. I'm going to pick her up from Union Station and then we're going to drive down to North Virginia to try that Korean spa, um, King Spa that everybody's talking about. So that should be fun. Um, I need to leave here at about 9. Well, I need to check because yesterday it said that it was 27 minutes away with traffic, even though it's only five miles away. So, yeah, I need to recheck because it's Monday and people got to work. But I don't know what I did with my phone. But either way, she um, texted me this morning. She's on the train. She's sending me all the pictures of her view. I'm so happy she's deciding to like get out and do things so i'm gonna pack up here and um head to go get her and then we're gonna head to the spa i don't know if i'm gonna take my camera i'll probably have to vlog some of my phone because i really like the sauna and i'm not trying to mess little buddy up okay in the steam room so i'll probably just end up like inserting some pictures or something but that should be fun so i will see you all once i get going and I'm on my way to getting where I'm getting okay I'm about 15 minutes away they left early so she thinks they should be there in about 20 minutes so hopefully I don't get turned around and hopefully it's just a smooth seamless process recent turn is this it 150 feet this one's supposed to go no that's Carson circle oh it's just, I hate when it tells you to make like a, a slight left but you're really just following the road. You got me thinking I messed up. I don't know if I'm gonna take my camera. I I don't want to, it's small, but I don't want to feel, I don't want anyone to feel like their privacy is being like infringed upon or anything. So I'll probably just take my phone and like snap pictures and like snap a couple phone videos like when nobody is in them and stuff like that, so. Just so you all can see the place and I can give like a nice little review, but so that nobody feels like uncomfortable. So, cause this little setup, I mean, I could take my camera like by itself, but then I would have to hold it and I don't wanna do that. If I'm gonna hold it, I might as well hold my phone and be able to do other stuff. So my skin looks really nice today. Very grateful. I started actually doing what I'm supposed to be doing and actually cleansing, like using my cleanser and using my moisturizer that has SPF in it so I need some chapstick but you know you can't be perfect I thought about bringing my car mount and then I didn't it would be the perfect time to bring the car mount because I haven't driven in DC that many times and we're not really on a time crunch but I don't want to get turned around and then this take longer than it has to but I would love to bring you all along on the journey so I might just have to um, hold you guys like right next to the steering wheel with me like this yes 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 i'm 14 minutes away now and i don't have to get on the highway i'm i might already be in dc i have no clue where i'm at honestly Okay, for real this time. 
I got here surprisingly easily. Um, and I'm gonna throw my hazards on. Nobody's behind me. But I think the middle lane is for like loading. Oh, let me turn this damn music off. Hold on. Um, but yeah, I got here surprisingly easily. I think the this middle lane that I'm in is for <laughs> juice is for um like pick up and drop off. So I call my mom, she's here, she's gonna run to the bathroom and then she's gonna come out. So yay! This was so simple. I'm so excited. Oh. Mush Mush Mondays or Mommy Mondays, but Mush Mondays sounds better since her name is Michelle and you know country folk like what kind of nickname is Mush? But I like it. So yes. Let me put some chapstick on because I've been talking about how chapped my lips are and now y'all probably see right up my nose. Look. Yay. Okay. And I think the spa is only about 45 minutes from here. At least that's what it said last night. So hopefully it's about the same time. I need to clean my car out. I should have. Oh, well. It says no waiting or parking anytime, but people are waiting and parking. I guess not parking technically because they're not like leaving their car. But, I don't know, this man is out. I don't know, maybe they're just kissing people goodbye. Okay, well. It's starting to drizzle. Something about the rain. I mean, I'm not completely upset. Oh, they're Uber. Yeah. Like, but haven't you had enough? They scared the shit out of me. Um, their Uber almost left them, poor thing. I'm gonna need the rain to let up for a little bit uh, because it's just, this is just like every day. And like pouring rain, like I think that's a bit much. So. Oh, my mom's calling me. Hello? Huh? I think I'm on Massachusetts. Oh, huh? Um, like if you come out and see them three big giant, um, American flags. I see one big giant American flag. Well, it's three of them. You might just be looking at one of them. And like, are you outside already? I mean, I just, no, I'm walking. I see the bottom of one as I'm walking out. Okay. Um, so do you see an orange trolley? Yes. Okay. So I'm across the street. Oh, okay. And like a little, um, if you cross that, it's another little brick sidewalk. Uh -huh. Um, and I'm inching up as people get out of their cars. Did you see the police? Yeah, the police just passed by. There was a white lady yeah, okay. with a blonde bun and spaghetti straps walking in. Okay, yeah. I have my hazards on. You see me? I was about to say, I see her. How you see her? Yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Beans. This was an easy, easy, peasy, nice trip. It sure was. You're, um... And I was a little queasy because I didn't know, like, where I'm going. Like, I've never been in the Southeast before. That's the adventure of it all. True. Damn, it's cold in here. Sorry. Good Jesus. <laughs> Good I was Lord. too, I was too busy focusing on... No, and you trying to make up for No, me they down. had too much, but it's just as on regular. Ooh, um, can we turn it off for a minute? Yeah. Well, it was also hotter, like uh -huh. when, because we had to walk. I'm, me and my steps, we getting it. Because getting it. <laughs> we had to walk to the, um, the parking garage, mm -hmm. and then I got hot. Okay, so now I need to change my GPS. I get this off. Front of us look like the closest we go here. Right. 
<laughs> We're at Food Lion now. True. Well, the sun is behind us. But we had a lovely spa day. Why are we at Food Lion, Mom? Hopefully they have the sale crab legs. The sale crab legs. The $5.99 crab legs. So we roll up in here and they're gonna have our crab legs. They're gonna have our crab legs. And then we're going to continue our journey. Oh shit. Getting started with the fireworks. I know, right? Oh, customer in training. Do they not look good? They look little? I'm just looking at them. Oh, at them. These look good. Okay, MVP price. Okay. You good? Mm -hmm. Yay! I told y'all we was going to find our crab legs. Oh lord, I'm be dropping crab legs. To send to the work group mm -hmm. chat that, that told you about the sale. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Hey y'all, it's like 11 o'clock at night. I am back home. I'm eating some ramen. <laughs> Only because I wanted to get ramen at the spa, but I was a little hot and I didn't want to like get the ramen and not like it. But at this point, you've already seen the spa footage that I have and know my thoughts. But just we had a really, really good time. Like my mom talked about how the day was just easy, like getting to the train station, parking, getting on the train, getting to D.C., getting to me once she got to D.C., was just a breeze and like me getting from Mercer's house to the train station and like the timing, timing up perfectly. It was just a really good day. We're def we definitely want to go back. And then of course you saw us getting crab legs. But what I didn't um, vlog, we ended up stopping at another food line to get more crab legs because her work group chat texted that there was a sale on crab legs at food line. So, and they were also saying that like the ones in Richmond are sold out. So. We found one on the way home and they had it. So she sent a picture to the group chat and then somebody called her like, where are you? Like, where, where is that? And do they have any left? And she was like, I'm in Northern Virginia. Um, so she was like, well, if I stop, if I, if I pass another one, I'll stop and see if they have some. And then we did literally drive right past another one. So we stopped and, um, got her coworker three bags, um, as well. So yeah, right now I am finishing up. The editing of the Cabo blog of the Cabo vlog part one. Whew. Right now, I'm just going through and getting little clips to um, make like a little preview to post on like Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube Shorts. And then after that, all I have to do is the final watch through, where I watch the whole entire video all the way through to make sure everything is looking like I want it to look. And after that, we export and um, upload to YouTube. I already made a thumbnail. So I just have to do the description and all that, but I can do all that in the morning. So I'm gonna finish working on that. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, I will see you all next time. But before I go, go watch the Cabo vlog. Like. By the time you see this, it's up and it is ready to be watched. And it needs you to watch it. If you've already watched it, go watch it again. But yeah, bye guys.